Welcome back to Farming Simulator 2015 with the Rude Man. I'm back on Thornton, and I want to show you a couple of mods that I picked up, see if they're worth looking at, but we'll take a look. Now, this mod I just showcased in another video, but I thought I'd use it anyway. And I picked up this. It's a Pottinger. Pottinger or Pottinger, however that's pronounced. Um... I had one of these in Farming Simulator 2013. And what makes it a little bit different from the usual uh, windrower is that this one is a front load windrower. Now, this is my first time looking at it. I just downloaded it because I was interested in it. The one that I had in 2013 was I can't remember. I think it was a Pottinger. It might have been it was green in color. And it was quite large. This one is a little different. There's only two uh, wheels on it. The other one had quite a few. Uh, the other mod that I picked up is this little bucket here. Now, this bucket is kind of cool because... Well, let me show you. Let me, let me get in the tractor here. And we'll take a look at these. I want to look at the little bucket first. I'm, I'm interested in it. What I'm going to do is let me uh let me see here i need to get inside the tractor and i need to switch this on and what that does if you didn't see the other showcase it it actually lowers that three point hitch so that way i can pick this bucket up let me do that and if you're interested in this tractor like i said i recently did a showcase on it and uh, you can go take a look at that if you want. So now that we have this bucket, let me see if that... All right, does it pick it up? It, it's supposed to pick it up. Well, we'll take a look at that. It is moving when I when I try to lift the the front end something's happening there All right I don't know if that's an issue with the tractor because it's not really picking it up let's see lower seed box all right lift seed box I don't know if that's an issue with the tractor or not but it's not lifting it very high but it doesn't seem it isn't it isn't doesn't seem to bother anything so let's let's check this out I had a reason for getting this if if you remember, I'm trying to start doing uh, at least one or two farms. This is one of them, where I'm trying to do things a little bit more realistically. And this one is interesting. This, I don't like that. Wished it lift up a little higher. Like I say, that might be the tractor, though. But let's see, where is my... There. Okay, what you do is you use this, it's called a seed box. And just like the name says, seed box, we're supposed to be able to come over here and pick up seed. So let's see how that works. All right, so we're just gonna fill that up. And as you see, it grabs seed and fills that box up. Now what I'm using in other maps is a utility pickup truck. Now it, you're noticing up here that it shows that my seeds are now 100%. I've filled that thing up. All right, so now in other maps I'm using a utility pickup truck. And that's fine, that's dandy, that's kind of modern. And this one though seems a little bit more A little bit more old style. So now you can take this thing out to the field and refill your cedars. And I thought that was kind of interesting. I really like this little fence. It's a cute little tractor. 
So we can run out to the field. I don't have a cedar out here. I'm just driving down to the field. That's where my other tractor's at. And I want to see if the issue with this thing not lifting off the ground is this tractor or not. Let's run this thing in here. All right, so let me unhook from this. But what you would do is you'd run over to your cedar and um, you just load the seeds from that from that seed box. Let's grab this tractor. And let me uh, let me drop my weight. latch on to this thing okay it must be a problem with that mod because it does it does lift it up and lower it properly with this tractor so it might be that mod that has the issue I still like that tractor but so then you would just run up to your cedar and uh, and load your seeds into the cedar from this tractor, which is kind of cool. So I kind of liked it because I thought it was a little bit more old school than a fancy new pickup that, you know, carries your seed and fertilizer. Now this is just a cedar, so this won't uh, fill your fertilizer tank, but I thought it was a little bit more appropriate to have something like this on a map like Thornton. But, um, yeah, so I'm probably going to use it on this map. All right, let's run and stick this thing here on the farm for now. And I'll run up and get that other... We'll run up and get that uh, wind drawer. Now, if you remember, in one of the last episodes, I just cut this grass. Let's see if we can windrow it. Man, that plane is loud. All right, let's see how this thing hooks up. Now, it, it, is, it does have a few issues. If you notice, it's kind of floating in the air. The other thing is... The detailing looks a little cartoony to me, and I and I don't know how else to explain it. That the first thing I I saw when I looked at it is it looked kind of well. It kind of looks like it's made out of PVC pipe, and and uh, you know, the details are a little weak. But let's just see how it functions. So. Let's see about spreading it out. We're spreading the news. All right, now, is it going to lower? Does it go clear to the ground like it's supposed to? Let's turn it on. And so it functions, but it's a little, it's a little funny because it doesn't look like it actually touches the ground. And again, the only reason I downloaded this one is because I had a front-loading wind drawer in um, Farming Simulator 2013, and I just loved it. It was, it was just kind of funky, and I liked it. So there you go. Well, it's, it seems like it does a pretty good job, and it it is kind of nice for a map that has small fields like this because it's not it's not overly large but it looks like it windrows pretty good. I think the only issue I have with it is it, the way it looks. It just looks, it looks, I don't know, I can't explain it. And that's why I described it as being cartoony. But it seems to work pretty good. Let's pick it up, refold it, and there you go. A front-end loading wind drawer. 
anyway there you go so we have two little mods I'm gonna use that cedar on this mod I don't know whether I'm gonna use this one or not because it's kind of it's kind of well it's kind of funky I like it don't get me wrong I like it but it's kind of funky anyway I hope you liked it and I'll see you on the farm in the next episode happy farming <laughs>